to our dearest siblings. Welcome back to our channel. I'm Becca. And I'm Katie. And we are back at it again with Outer Wilds this week. We had a little bit of issues last time. We kind of died a lot. <laughs> yeah, but I feel like that's par for the course for us. So that's good. We have the know my honor side, <laughs> so we can keep playing. And let's get into it. Okay. <laughs> Deep breath time with Deep Jeb. Time. Meditation with Jeb. Stare at the fire. Breathe deeply. <sighs> Let's go die in space. Heck yeah. Okay. Um. So here's the million dollar question. Do we go die in Brittle Hollow and get ejected from the black hole for the millionth time? Or we do we follow the lead to go to Ashen Twin? Um, I kind of want to go to Ashen Twin and see what's going on there. That is fair. Also, hmm. I don't know. I just, I just think like, we spent so much time at Brittle Hollow. <laughs> We did, but we haven't learned anything that we were supposed to, because I didn't. Well, we, we've learned some things. I don't think that's it. You don't? No. You do? Yeah. Is that okay. not it? Can't... You can, like... It, it is Ash Twin. <laughs> I'm dumb. There we go. We got it. <laughs> Let's find Ash and Twin. Ladies and is. gentlemen, we are navigators. Call us Lewis and Clark. <laughs> Oh, oh yeah. Well, that'd be pretty accurate because they didn't know where the fuck they were going. Exactly. <laughs> we have yet to find our third, infinitely smarter companion who actually knows how to do things. Yes. If you're out there, let us know. <laughs> let us know. We're ready. <laughs> help. Please help. There's nothing here. It's just a big old golf ball. <laughs> Uh, what, what about the other thing that's next to it? Like, the mechanical thing? It's like... Yeah, I can go check that out. Orbiting it. Oh, that's definitely got something. <laughs> uh, yeah. I just went to the wrong golf ball planet. Interesting. Oh, that looks like one of the escape pods. Yeah, it does. And then some so ruins. Like yeah, this- oh, wow, that looks a lot like everything on Brittle Hollow. Yeah. Okay, where am I gonna park? Up here. Gently. That was a lot softer than I anticipated that I thought I was gonna smack that ground. Nah, you're too epic for that. Too epic. That's exactly how I describe myself. Oh, it is okay. dark. <laughs> what? Don't worry. I've got a flashlight. A flashlight. But I never... Oh, look, there's a pillar on there. It wasn't just a golf ball. Oh. Well, we'll start on this well, one. Well, there's she. Oh, my gosh. Is she gonna... Come here? She's coming right for us. Oh. Hi. Hello. Bye. Okay. Well, I have fallen down. But we can, in fact, get back up, so it'll be okay. There's a little, like, arch that we can just walk through, too. Yeah, I'm just gonna go that way. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe Ooh. simple. Oh. Ooh! Good thing we went to the arch. So Can't it's, it. it's broken. broken yeah. But there's definitely things here. Important yeah. things. I think there might be something relevant here. Unidentified signal nearby. Oh boy, howdy. Let me hear her. It's a distress beacon. Yeah. But there's an unknown one. But I can't let it make it go closer. Weird. There we go. Is there something on the surface of the sun? Did you see that? Um, no, it's just yeah. something in or No, it is on the surface of the sun. It was like orbiting it. What the hell is that? Okay. I want to touch it. Okay, and there's like a ring over there too. Yeah, it's just a solar flare. 
Those are just slow. Okay. So there might be something to investigate on the sun. How are we going to investigate it without dying? No idea. <laughs> okay. No clue. Yeah, yeah, I heard. Wow. Wow. You're in distress. Is the sun going to blow up or something? <laughs> no, it would never. It would never. What? I am overcompensating. Oh no. <laughs> you're for everything. Here. You're just used to being on Giants Deep where like yeah, getting around anything was terrible. <laughs> True. And Nona, we need a status report for all systems. But initial things first. Is everyone unharmed? Hopefully. Next page. Rush. Our escape pod's passengers are afraid, but physically well. Anona, everyone survived the crash. Let's get here. This is a relief. At least, you have my gratitude. Burr, were you able to find the other escape pod's distress signals? <laughs> I was. I can hear both signals somewhere in the star system, but I don't believe either escape pod crashed on the same planet as us. That's true, because one of them crashed on Brittle Hollow. That is true. We don't know where the other one is. Well, we got an updated ship log. That's it. That's the episode. We did our one productive thing. Uh, thank you so much. Play the ending song. <laughs> Many I've been in one things. of these before. Many more things. I would like to read, please. Too close to target text. <laughs> Scanning external environment. Scan complete. External temperature is prohibitively high. Verdict. Inhospitable. Do not seek shelter on planet surface. Hmm. There goes my dreams of creating a summer chateau on Ash. Wait, Twilight. but there was more rings that you could have read. That was just the one, the bottom one. Ugh! I guess! I'm sorry. So it's really hot on this planet. I mean, that makes sense. It's really close to the sun, but... Yeah. Alert. Collision imminent. Preparing for impact. Oh, hey, Becca. The last time that we did this, we only read one of them. Oh. Nice. <laughs> launching escape pod three. Now launching escape pod two. Wait, they started with three? Weird. Well, wasn't. Escape pod two. Vessel has been mortally injured. An emergency sequence activated. Awaiting temperature from vessel. Departure. Um, interesting. Okay. I wonder if the Nomai aren't from this system. That would make sense. Yeah. Malor, the heat from the star system sun is more bearable below the surface. There's more pages. No. Yes. No more reading. Only reading. <laughs> uh. When our escape pod punctured this planet's surface, it broke into what scans show is a cave system with much cooler air. I would recommend we seek a site down there to build a long-term shelter. Anona, but these passages are a maze. Hmm. A puzzle, you say? <laughs> oh no. Even with this danger, there is still our best chance for survival. We'll form teams and descend into the caves to look for a shelter site. We can make our findings on the walls to avoid it becoming irre irreversibly lost. Okay. I don't, don't use big words. I can't read. Be cautious, everyone. And be aware of the sand as you search. It appears to be rising gradually. Okay. So two important things to know here. We need to look for the signs on the walls because it'll tell us where to go. But we also need to make sure to not get crushed by sand. Yeah, because it's rising gradually. But what do we do? Sorry, I didn't mean to do that. When it rises. I don't know. I would like to read it, please. Leave, maybe? 
Escape. Emergency escape hatch. Mm. Well, that was already blown off. So it looks like there's two different ways we can go. To the right and to the left. I have three minutes of oxygen remaining. Oh. Keep moving, friends. There's nothing of interest at the end of this passage but rocks. Okay. And while these rocks are interesting, they can wait until a less urgent time. Oh, I wonder if there's some of the, like, quantum rock things. Do the cactus not provide oxygen? That sucks. Hold on. Breathe! No. No? Dang. Don't work. Where's the shot? Do not follow this tunnel to its end. Colossus and I will examine the horror that lies at its terminant later. Provide, provided we live through its... Oh, this. now I really want to go into this tunnel, though. <laughs> mm, I want to go! What's down here? gonna be like ghost matter it does it just end I'm like nervous <laughs> oh wait that's just nothing is it is it the, the white hole maybe from space I like literally jump back in my chair I was oh it's an angler fish but it's dead Cool. And our ship log updated. Yo, two updates? We're doing great. There's something down there. <gasps> there's text. So there's another way to get there. Somehow. Yeah. Some way. Somehow. Okay, well, we explored that. Should I retrieve the scout? Um, Probably. Yeah. I just did. Also took a nice little photo. Just in case. Just in case. I I'm am kind of shocked that there is no oxygen yet because i feel like the places that have a lot of information yeah, tend to bad. have one place that has an oxygen site you know yeah yeah we're supposed to keep an eye on the sand uh looks, an eye on looks you. good right now good sand all right i need oxygen actually yeah unfortunately to the ship Oh! <laughs> you might as well refuel our uh, gas while we're in here too. Oh my god, Mega. Okay. Well, that's a win. That's a win. We got it. We okay. had oxygen to spare. Oh, okay. Okay. Well, with that done, sun, heat. We return. We return. Just super speed back down to those caves and see what else is there. So my question is, what do the Nomai need for, like, life? Because obviously not the same type of oxygen as us. Probably not. Well, I don't know. They have trees and all of their things, so I don't know if I could... You can really assert that either. That's true, but like these little cave systems don't have any oxygen. And a lot of the ruins don't have any oxygen. That's fair. We have found an enormous cavern at the end of this passage that appears promising. I believe we can construct long term shelter there. Ooh. Noise, noise, noise. The cavern where Lore found is a wise choice for shelter. Could one of you mark directions for the others to follow? This is the start of the path to the shelter site. I've left directions to guide you there. Okay. Of note, we must hurry. As the pathway there is filling with sand, do not allow yourself to be buried by sand and make sure no one is lost. Oh. So I probably will get there and it'll be blocked off by sand, but we can see. Yes. I'm going to super speed down this pathway. Whoa. There's a lot of sand. And just filling with more sand. Can we not walk it through is... it? I don't know. It's just rising really fast. Ooh, okay. We can walk through it. Good news. But I don't see any markings. Mm, is what's no. concerning me. Uh, 
Yeah, I would go up here because it looks like there was a bridge there at some point. Yeah. Or no, is it a dead end? Yeah, this is a dead end. Okay. So then the other way? We can try it. That's the way we came from. Is a way over here? Yeah. Oh, there is. Nothing. Nothing. Okay, cool. Uh oh. We're gonna get smushed by sand. Oh no. <gasps> yep. I did not like that sound. <laughs> squishy. Wow, that rises really fast. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So, I say we turbo speed back to Ash and Quinn and all of this fun stuff. And try to find the ruins. Yeah. We And junk. Oh, whoa. Hello? Yeah, you see the little, like, things? Yeah. I wonder if you I'm... just walk down that, if that's the path you're supposed to take through the tunnels. I wonder. Let me unbuckle. Do we do that, or do we want to try to find the settlement? I mean, I think we could try it, because that, if okay. that does lead to the settlement, we won't have to go through the maze. <laughs> L O L. Oh, it is loud. Why is it so loud? Um, what is oh. that? That's the sand. It looks oh. like sand coming from the golf ball. Okay, so it, it moves. moves. Okay. okay. Not a fan of that. So probably don't get caught in that. Yeah, that's it's a good call. probably a bad idea. So if you go back that way, what does it lead to? The pod. Oh. And an unidentified signal. That is your why. Hmm. Um, do we continue exploring this? I think it will just be a different part of... I agree. I think we should go back to what we were doing before. Okay. We'll come back to her. You may want to turn your flashlight on. That's a good call. I live in darkness. <laughs> yeah. Did you see how graceful that was? Like a ballerina. Like a ballerina. I just, my natural inclination is just to like womp on the acceleration for everything. <laughs> so, which like since this is like a flight simulator game everything just says okay you want to go there let's go there fast yeah. so so not this way like you see that yeah Can... let's go that way Wee. Wah, wah. tell me your secrets of note this passage leads to breathable air <laughs> Becca. Refill your supply tank there. We cannot tell how far deep these tunnels may wind, but do not linger as this area is exposed to the heat of the alien sun. Cool. <laughs> Let's go Woo! fill up on oxygen real quick. So, yes, what I was saying before was correct about usually these areas have some, yeah. some oxygen. Refill your air supply tank and return quickly. Okay. I really think, because, like, we were on the surface of the this for a hot sec, and nothing happened. So I think maybe yeah. the Nomai are really poorly equipped to handle heat. I could believe that. Oh, that is where we came from. Yes. I'm trying to remember. This way, yes. Where? Um, so we just need to look for text. There's some down there. Oh, okay, cool. Um, we. <laughs> I would like to read, but quickly. 
The path to the shelter site is somewhat convoluted, so follow the instructions ahead closely. Thanks. Okay. Puzzle. Why why must it be convoluted? <laughs> Cause nothing is easy. To reach the shelter site, walk forward until you meet the sandfall at the pit, then turn left. Continue to the room filled with rock column formations and climb upward through the opening above them. <laughs> I'm not gonna remember all that. Um, the sand here is rising, so you must be can, cautious and swift. Tell me again. Uh, forward till sandfall. Turn left. Uh, rock column. Then opening above them. Okay. I figured it may be the case because. Okay, so then take a left. And then up. This is another sandfall. Yeah. Do you think I passed it? Um, no, maybe continue on. Ah, oh, crap. Uh, for sure did. Yeah. Okay. okay, we went in a circle. So, hold on. Read it again. Forward. Then left. And then continue to a room filled with rock columns formation, Column formation. and climb upward. Okay, so sand pit, that's forward. Then left. left. You were you're going right. I am going right. I don't know direction. Left. Yes. To, is uh, it okay, this is that's the room. Yeah. And then up. Yes. Okay. Um, is there text somewhere? No, no but there's only okay. one way you can go. Yeah. Well, I didn't know if it was going to give us, like, direction stages. Yeah. Oh, there it is. Here's the next stage. Tell Shit. And I went up. <laughs> Read. Read, please. Be cautious, crossing the chasm ahead. The bridge Malor and I crafted will do its job. But it isn't strong. Oh god. So we're gonna have to fly. Yeah. Once on the far side, look for the tunnel hidden behind the falling sand. Follow it, and you'll reach the shelter side. Okay, so tunnel okay. behind the sand. Um, so I'm just gonna have to fly. We made it! And tunnel behind the sand. Yes. Haha! We got it! You're doing well. There's only a little further left. Go now until you reach the shelter site. You can rest there. Hurry before the sand comes. Okay. It looks like a pit. Yeah, I would go across to the other side. You see? Right there. Yeah. We did it! <sighs> Play the music. Okay, and there's stairs to somewhere. And a big door. And a, and a big old door. With I arrows. think that's where they want us to. <laughs> I think we're supposed to go up the stairs. <laughs> okay. Hello. Log updated. And there's there are definitely some trees. Some trees. That's which good. is very good for when you're means. Anglerfish. Fossil, Fossil overlook. overlook. Oh, okay, so this is how we get to that skeleton we saw before. Yeah. I'm gonna go... Over to the trees. Oh, wait, I almost missed something. Let's... Okay, that's a big hole. I don't like that. Looks like there's supposed to be a teleport thing going on yeah. there. But there sure isn't. Is there anything on the other side? The other side. Of, yeah, like of this level. So oh. if you walk back out and you go over, yeah. Yes. Look. Ooh, did almost jump down into the chasm. Oof. Which is fine. I didn't do it though. We did it. We lived. Three minutes of oxygen. Okay, three minutes of oxygen. We got it. It's but right there's there. trees, it's so we're good. Yeah. There's a, a lot Lots of, of bodies. Yeah. What what was that thing? 
It wasn't a body. That, that yeah. It's an exit question. Huh. Um, who knows? It looks like the face that we see. Yeah. When we die. It's weird. It's kind of like um, a tribal mask is what it reminds me of. Yeah, a little bit. Yeah. So I wonder, is it like the Nomai's god? Nah, I think we have to do with science. I uh, yeah, everything has been very sciencey so far. I don't think. It's I a think I I'd, I'd be shocked if it it flipped into religion. <laughs> so like, it's all about Jesus. Hmm. I would like to know what's going on in there. How do I get in there? Okay, these rocks don't look very structurally sound. I'm sure I could push it in, in if I wanted. Uh, I am gonna go get oxygen though. But the game does not want you to, so <laughs> he said no. Game dev said no. Which, you know. Do you think I, I can just float across? Um, maybe. I'm gonna try it. Cause, yeah, for sure. Because gravity is super low here. Yeah. <gasps> I breathe. Everybody do your meditations with Jeb. <laughs> Should we build the sun station to power the Ash Twin project? Okay, so we did see the sun station. Hmm. Are there other ways to generate this level of power? Ugh, so much reading. Oh no, not reading. Theoretically, yes. Practically, no. I can't imagine it discovering them in our lifetime. I understand this proposal is unsettling, but the sun station must be built if we hope to complete the Ash Twin project. Yo, do you think they were trying to harvest that energy and they made it explode? Mm, possibly. I almost can't comprehend. This is being suggested seriously. The purpose of the sun station goes against every standard we hold ourselves to and everything we believe in as a species. Oh. And God, it's just a bunch of greedy capitalists. Unsurprisingly. Idea. Idea. I disagree. We're pushing a possible new technology further than ever before. That, in my experience, is the defining characteristic of our species. If we fail, and probability of this is non not insignificant, we will, without question, destroy ourselves, all life here, and the rest of the star system. I hope to protect these species. So they are the reason the sun explodes. They are. The potential annihilation of an entire star system is too severe a cost. We shouldn't build the sun station, no matter how badly we want the knowledge that comes from it. Oh, my oh God. I bet that's what's on the outside of the sun, is the sun station. Yeah. Fear of failure is a poor reason not to try. I believe if we're cautious, the sun station will work. I believe in pie. Poke. I'm deeply honored. Idea. I comprehend your position. However, if we aren't all but certain the sun station will not cause destruction once we've built it, then I won't support the station's use. Wow. They made the sun explode. Yeah. That's... So probably the thing that's keeping us alive is an invention by Idea or Colossus, that person. Because they wanted to protect everyone. I thought there would be something on the second level, but I don't think there is. Yeah. Aesthetics, that's what's, that's what's there. It's pretty. Okay, that's really interesting. There's things here. This probably controls where the elevator thing goes to. Yeah, so Anglerfish yeah. Outlook. Stepping Stone District. High energy lab trailhead. I shrine district. Okay. Well, um, pick your poison. I think we should go to the lab. Okay. Because I think That's that will tell us more about what they're doing with the sun station. I agree. Take me there. Okay, so if you go over to the side. There was oh. a... 
Like a little platform that then... Over here? The sand is rising. Oh. I, I don't think we'll be empty. able to get there anymore. Yeah. We're not going to be able to get there anymore. Do we need to, like, leave? Um... Because the sand is rising? We may die. Go, go into that little... Thing. This thing. Yeah. I wonder if there's anything... Sand. Coming very quickly. And this is... Yeah. Okay. Yeah. We should maybe go. <laughs> um... Give me a second. Let me oh, reorient beans. and then try again. Oh, beans. Oh, shit, we're gonna die. Oh, no, no, no. Okay, let me just ignore that. I'm gonna go up here and just go the easy way. I'm going up the steps. This way. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh, please no. tell me this is a way out. <laughs> This is amazing. Look inside the cave. How did this come to rest here? We haven't encountered others in these caves. I think it's a rare find. Is this the fucking it's, anglerfish? It's, it's the anglerfish. I can almost guarantee it. From what we can see, Colossus and I... It's Colus, whatever. Colus. <laughs> I believe this specimen must be very old indeed. Imagine what we might learn if we could examine it. We both agree it is an unlikely that a dry planet in this horror's place of origin, especially considering what we observed during the vessel's evacuation. Clearly, this hole is too small for it to have fit through. Hypothesis. There is another entrance to this cave. If there, Colossus and I will find it. We can't leave a valuable information undiscovered. Colossus. Again, Garbo and Colossus. <laughs> An update. <laughs> we find a way inside quickly. Lore, because when I returned here to search for an entrance to the cave, there was children playing on the specimen. What? There were children playing on the bones. I mean, it's, it's definitely the anglerfish. Yeah. But can we see children? Uh, I just see no. sand. We should Finding. go. We should go. So quickly. <laughs> we should find a way out. <laughs> Let me leave. Oh god. We're gonna have to go back through. We are so boned. We are so dead. Ooh. There's no way. Because we have to go down. Yeah. Wow. How are we supposed to survive this? I'm confused. Maybe there's like parts of the game where you can like explore it, but there's really no way to survive. We're gonna die. Yeah. yeah we're gonna well, you know, that nice, nice, squishing noise. Mm. Everybody's favorite. Okay, well, we learned a lot of information. Yeah. Wow. So, okay. okay, so the Nomai are the reasons that we're in this loop, both yeah. in their technology and in the fact that they're probably the reason the sun keeps exploding. Yeah. I mean, I'm not shocked. <gasps> we definitely... Oh, oh, whoa, what? That's new. Uh, is that the moon? Is that the wandering moon? Where's she going? I don't know. Okay, goodbye. <laughs> Alright. Um. Much like the wandering moon. <laughs> it's time for us to... To move forward. Yes. <laughs> to say goodbye and move on. Um, well, we learned a lot. Um, definitely the Nomai. There's something shady going on there. I think we should definitely go back and explore Ashen's Plan as much as possible. Yeah. Didn't beat the game this time. Um, no blue sun explosion. But a lot of information nonetheless. Sincerely yours. <laughs>